Well, no one will be more disappointed than supporters in Murray's hometown of Dunblane. Our correspondent, Katrina Renton, is there. And need I ask what the atmosphere is, Katrina? <laughs> It's a very different atmosphere here in this pub now than there was when we got here at 8 o'clock this morning. Now, it's a different crowd that are here now. It's starting to fill up with football fans. But when we got here this morning, it was full of Andy Murray fans hoping beyond hope that this, his third Grand Slam final, would be third time lucky for him. But it just wasn't to be. And local people here are very disappointed but also extremely proud of Andy Murray. And they say, remember, well, he didn't win. Well, he made it to the final and he made it to the final this time last year, the same Australian Open final where we were all here then and we'd all had our fingers crossed for a different outcome this time. Now we've been told not to lose heart as all some of the greatest tennis players of our time, amongst them Andre Agassi didn't win his first few shots at a Grand Slam, it happened for him later in the day and we were talking to children this morning who are all inspired by Andy White, he's a great reputation for this town. Okay, Katrina, thank you very much. At least not everybody is totally disappointed now.